So you want to know how to shoot for Nike? Here's how I did it. Bruh, I feel like it's been such a long time since I made a vlog style video, it's insane. But we have a crazy one for y'all today. I'm gonna be shooting for Nike, which is crazy because this is the second time that I'm shooting for Nike. The first time I feel like I didn't get to record a proper vlog for you guys. I did record, so I'll kind of show you some clips and stuff from that. So right now, currently, I just wanted to document this process because I'm shooting for Nike. So I don't know how I'm gonna like piece this all together, but I want to get like my whole like raw, not reaction, but just like in the moment trying to go through what's going on. So right now it's about 10.58 p.m. I'm trying to piece everything together, go through like pictures, mood boards, inspo, old stuff from Nike. Like, I don't know how I'm gonna go through this yet, but just wanted to just tap in with y'all and just know that like this joint is really real. I'm probably gonna make a whole video about it that's way more put together, but I just wanted to document this just for the sake of doing it. All right, so I just got the kicks and low key I was a little bit worried because they're a day late, but for whatever reason, shipping has been like really weird as of lately, but um, got them in. The turnaround is really quick, so that's why I was kind of worried. Literally had to have these pictures like turned into them by like the weekend, but got the kicks right here and let's look at them real quick. So here they are, man. They are the waffle ones. So I'm gonna be styling these. I'm actually gonna hit the Grove tonight and try to pick up some Nike gear to kind of like go with these shoes. So got the kicks in. Now we can really get started and we're gonna shoot like Friday morning. So hopefully everything runs smooth. This is like the quickest I've tried to like do a campaign, but we got it, man. We got it, you feel me? Right, so we got the Grove right now. I'm about to go in the Nike and see what they got so I can uh, grab some stuff for this photo shoot. So I'm still kind of like unsure. I haven't went to the second level here yet, but um, I might grab this, I don't know yet. For shoot number one, we actually shot at Dover Street Market in Los Angeles for all of you who recognize the all white stairs. But I felt like this would be a perfect location to contrast this all orange fit that I have on. The pants are a cold wall. You guys see me pick up the Nike jacket. I also threw in the cold wall vest here. We're gonna go ahead and get into today's photo shoot, which I will be styling the Court Vision Low. So it's these joints right here, man. They're pretty much like a more affordable Air Force One. I think they're like right under $100. So pretty much the whole campaign that I'm doing is affordable Nike shoes under $100. So those are the shoes we're gonna be styling, but this is the fit I'm putting with it. So we're gonna start off with the top. So right here I have this Arizona denim jacket, which fits me really, really well. Um, right underneath it, we're gonna be wearing this beater, and then I got this red hat right here for minimal. So that's gonna be it for the tops, but then underneath, we got the G-Star flares right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it on, that way you guys can kinda see what it's looking like, but then we're gonna go ahead and go to the shoot. I gotta meet my boy Jonas over in Culver City, and it's gonna be a fire photo shoot today. So happy to bring y'all along, let's go. All right, so I'm pretty sure this is gonna be the fit as y'all can see, look at the proportions, bruh. Like, come on, yo. And I got the glasses too, hold on. So I added these glasses as well. Um, I'm probably gonna switch it around, so I might take the hat off, I might take the glasses off. We'll see. And I think I'm finna add the grills in there too to make it look extra crispy. But that's pretty much it, man. I gotta go ahead and head out. We out. Yeah, man, we at the spot right now. Got my yes, boy, sir. you know what I'm saying? Shooter is here, so finna get some good pics today. I'm gonna put y'all up on a tripod or something so y'all can see the behind the scenes, but yeah, man, we here. Some testers in right here. I'm not gonna do the pants yet. Just put your pants on. And then put your pants on.
moving spots. It's right here. We're gonna be on this little hill type thing. So. I've done so far with Nike but I didn't want to leave you guys with such a short vlog so enjoy the rest of the vlog which is just gonna be me shopping over the weekend all right so I'm not gonna lie I don't quite know where and which vlog this is gonna be in but I did want to make sure that I pick up the camera and bring you guys along with what I got going on today now I'm gonna explain it to you more as we're walking and going throughout the day but I do first gotta pick out an outfit to wear now what I can say is that we are going shopping so you know we got to step out and be fly but it has been extremely hot in LA as of recent I think today is probably gonna be another 90 degree day so whatever I wear definitely has to be weather appropriate all right so we got the outfit situation figured out to kind of run you guys through it real quick on the top we got this nice Jaden London knit right here which is super lightweight I know I just told y'all it's gonna be mad hot outside but this has like big enough holes to where you can't even like feel the knit for real now obviously this is my first time wearing it i just showed it to you guys so we're actually going to be testing and seeing if it's really hot to wear in the summertime but i think we should be straight i just got a nice little tank top underneath for the pants i also got the jaden london parachute pants you feel me these are like honestly like my favorite right now but i'm not even gonna lie to you but for the shoes, we got the good togas. So that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, uh, I also got this chain that is actually by me, but I don't want to talk too much about it because it hasn't came out yet. But be on the lookout for this joint soon, man. I've been kind of like test wearing it to see how I like it, but I'll explain it to y'all when I really get to dropping this joint. So we're gonna go ahead and head out. All right, so basically what we got going on today is I'm gonna be checking out different Gap stores to see if they got the Yeezy Gap stuff, you feel me? But right now, we at the P.O. box, I'm gonna grab some stuff. I also gotta pay it off, so. Um, yeah, man, that's pretty much what the day intakes. As soon as I leave from here, um, we're gonna figure out which one got the Yeezy Gap stuff, and hopefully they got something, so yeah. So I don't know if you guys can see this, but if you go to the section of the Yeezy Gap store that says stores, it will actually tell you which stores carry which items. And I think I'm gonna either try this Glendale one or the Grove. I might have to try both if one of the other doesn't have it, but I think I'm gonna go to Glendale first and see. So I'm switching to the iPhone with it. Right now we at the Glendale Galleria trying to find out where the Gap store is even at. I've been to this mall before uh, plenty of times, but I can never like remember where certain stores are, especially stores I don't really go to. I don't go to Gap, so this is my only reason to really be going there, you feel me? So we about to find out if they got the stuff or not. I'm also only interested in the hoodie, to be honest. I know they're probably gonna have a plethora of like long sleeves and stuff like that, but I'm really only in search of the hoodie. three different hoodies to try on this first one is the dove shrunken hoodie in the dark gray colorway i like the hoodie but i think it isn't slouchy enough for me the next one is the regular dove hoodie in this dark blue colorway it's a lot more slouchy this right here is a size large so you can kind of see how much it like drapes and looks a lot more baggy and cozy um, the difference between this one and the last one is the hoodie and of course the way it fits i actually really enjoy this colorway but i ended up getting the gray instead so this is the dark gray hoodie that i'm referring to they did actually have the t-shirts and the long sleeves which i probably should have tried on but i went with the hoodies instead 
All right, so I'm back at the crib with it. Y'all just see me come back from the Gap store that was carrying the Yeezy Gap stuff. And I'm not gonna give too much of an in-depth opinion on the hoodie. I'm kind of just here to show it to y'all because I just picked it up. But um, definitely be on the lookout for the full review and if I think that this hoodie is actually worth it or not. But to give you guys a quick little rundown, I did cop it in, I think this is the dark gray colorway. I think they have a washed black and then I think they have a black. But went ahead and went with the dark gray colorway. I do have similar hoodies to this, so I will be comparing it in my full review video of this but overall i think it's a it's a pretty nice hoodie bro like it, it fits super slouchy this one is called the dove hoodie even though they all have doves on the back of it they have this version which is a lot more baggy and slouchy and then they also have what's called the shrunken hoodie which the, you guys will be able to see in the video but yeah man that is the yeezy gap hoodie but I'm not gonna talk y'all's head off too much about it. I'm probably gonna be doing more shopping throughout the weekend, so that's probably what y'all are gonna see next. Fuck you, Quinn. <laughs> Baby, look at the money we make yeah, I can tell you everything, but I don't know. How Alright, so as promised, we own Rodeo Drive with it. Well, we're about to be on Rodeo Drive with it. And let y'all peep the fit, stuff like that. That's it. Got a little chrome on the, on the tank. Ricks. Same shoes that I had on earlier in the vlog, got the tokens on, and then um, last Prada. I forget what brand this is called, but it's probably whatever is on the front of my thing. But yeah, man, we here shopping. Oh yeah, y'all know the necklace, but that's top secret. But I'm gonna show you a fit too. Here we got Miss Too Cool for School. Got her outfit. She got on the Marine Sarah on the top. Top secret chain, <laughs> Balenci shades. You know, Jade London pants. Then she said she got the, the Wally's on, <laughs> but the mud's hitting though, so yeah. Yo, I haven't been to Rodeo Drive and I don't know how long, but we are here today because I wanna hit the Balenciaga store, try some stuff on, and um, kinda get some sizes and stuff like that in case I order something. I think I'm gonna try to go to the G-Star store maybe and see if they got those other pants. Um, and then there's supposed to be like the Louis Vuitton exhibit back, so we're gonna see if that's there and if it is, We'll stop at that, and I think that should be it. Yeah. Man, makes sense. That month is crazy. You know my birthday's next month? <laughs> what you say? My birthday's next month. <laughs> Look at him. Yeah. And my birthday's next month. Mm. Give him a good sound. It's That's not what I meant. Huh? That's not what I meant. Pop. It kind of reminds me of like a soccer jersey. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, I like it though. Mm -hmm. Also, the chain hitting on that one. No cap. I said they ain't yeah. got nothing on my joint though. Oh, I want it. I, I hear you. I can't even see what they look like. A little hard though. So I think this is where the pop up is supposed to be, and I don't think that it's ready yet. Oh, it is ready. Yeah, I didn't know this was ready yet. It's pretty far though. This is crazy. 
crazy. This is new. Everything went left right in front of my eyes. I don't want no less, I got more in mind. Yeah. I been taking steps, roll it up in life. Roll it up in life. The way she grab my neck, still give me butterflies. Don't matter how hard I try, still got so on my mind. Baby, can we get it right? I don't want this shit to end the night. Baby, I can't count up everything I went and bought. We moving too quickly, baby, let's give it some thought What I said a little crazy, now I'm out the box She keep changing keys on me, now I can't get the lock Yeah, I know what it's not You go home for a day and then you pull up on the dock Tell me I'm wrong, I know that shooters by the knock Take me wrong, I hope that this shit never stop I must be a little complacent Thought I could buy all of your love taking you places So that's pretty much it for the vlog, man If you made it to the end, I really appreciate it And I would definitely be back to you guys with more, man Peace